There are many events that are happening on the field that are all big vibrational components to it. Smacking a home run, dribbling a ball, all of these things create vibrations. And if we're able to deliver that directly to somebody else, it makes you feel like you're there on the field as well. And so that happened to be the case in our very first pilot program that we did with the Minnesota Twins from Major League Baseball. They wanted to see if there was a way to give that sensation of being at home plate to people that are all the way up in the you know, left outfield. Edge Sounder Research is a company that is aimed to try to re-question how we interact with sound. And it does it a number of ways, but the first way that we're looking at doing that is by trying to see if we can take vibration, which is all sound, and be able to give that back to the person in the most truest and un unfiltered way as possible. Our first product, the Resonex, is basically this box that is also structurally significant to be able to transfer vibrations in the exact way so that way there's as little loss as possible in transmitting vibration. Most products and things that are designed to be able to eliminate vibration and we're diving into the fact that this thing makes vibrations and trying to figure out what uh, enhances it as much as possible. We end up just making most of these devices here in-house, which means that we've had the conception to the ideation to the printing of all components and 3D printing. All of that happens with our team, a very small team of students and post-students from UCR. UCR helped us tremendously in the form of giving us support when, you know, it's an unproven technology, it's unproven research, and they gave us the, the wherewithal, the resources, and the ability to be able to look into this field that no one else did. Part of that's part of being in an academia, but a lot of this wasn't about being in academia. It's one thing to say that it's something's possible, and it's another thing to give the resources to prove that it's possible and to actually prove it out. And that's something that I hope that other students get to explore the way that we did.